I have been waiting to do this craft for literally months. I think I found the idea for this on TikTok in like September or October, something like that. And I was like, I have to do it. So I ran out to Target, I bought the materials, and then I waited. I got this little box ahead of my most recent Harry Styles Love On Tour concert. It's Harry's house, right? So I'm gonna fill it with feathers that I gathered. It's gonna be like a little Harry's house commemorative from that concert. I was so happy to find this at Target. I just love it. It's so cute and I think it's gonna look really good like on my bookshelf. So it's called Wood Display Box. It was $5 like in the $5 section at the front of Target. Let me show you some of the other materials I have. I also have a bunch of letters. We have like, I don't even know where we got these. We have like 15 different kinds of letters that I could have used for this. I have no idea why we have so many different sets of alphabets. Here are these like glittery ones. I thought these would be fun so I might do these just because I think they'll stand out a little more against like feathers. I'm not exactly sure but I also have these like black ones. They're a little more boring but I'm not really sure what's gonna fit well. My plan is to either put the letters like on the top here so you can see it while you're like looking at it from the top because I don't feel like I want to put it on the front. I just want to look at the feathers. I also need to show you the key factor for this. So this is my bag of feathers that my mom and I collected from the ground at the forum. There are drifts of feathers everywhere, as you probably have seen. And we tried to get like a good assortment. You can see I had a glove to do it because it was a little gross, obviously. Like you can imagine crawling around on the floor, trying to pick up these feathers from people's boas. If you were at Love on Tour LA Night 8, one of these might have been from your boa. I don't know. I myself did not have a boa, so these are not from my boas. So these are all from other Harry's. Thank you, Harry's, for your unknowing contribution. And it's going to make me a wonderful decor item. I think I'm gonna do this downstairs. It might be a little messy, just like taking feathers out of the bag and everything. They have been in that bag for two months. So I've been putting this off, but I'm really excited to do this now. So let's head downstairs, let's get everything set up, and let's make it. done and that was honestly the easiest craft I've ever done. Put the feathers in, put the stickers on, and that's it and it's like my favorite decor item. So let me show you guys how it turned out. I just think it's so beautiful. It's so much fun. It's just so commemorative because these feathers, we crawled around on the ground to pick them up. They're from the forum, from other fans. We endured some pretty weird looks. Picking up feathers, putting them in the bag. I think it's just awesome. I kind of wish I would have had one for my other concerts as well because I think it'd be really cool to have a collection of them. I'll show you what I put on the top. So I chose the glitter stickers. They were a little annoying to work with, to be honest. And I don't love how some of the letters look. Like, tell me that's not a J. Like, I know it was in the T spot, but like, it looks like a J. I also don't love how the eight looks. You can't really tell it's an eight. Kind of looks like a an S or something, but I think you get the point pretty well, at least. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me put together this craft. It's like literally the easiest thing ever, and it's so much fun, especially if you are going to be going to a Love On Tour concert soon. Make sure to check out all of my other Harry videos. I have a lot from concerts and crafts and knitting and 
all that stuff. Check out my other videos if you like. But yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.